job, buddy. So today we're going fishing for cod. She's not wrong. Morning, guys. Max Lenny, Miranda Bell, Allie, heading out to our secret spot down here in Southern California. We're going for rockfish today. Specifically looking for vermilion rockfish, link cod, starries, chuckleheads. The list goes on and on. If it says it's about 300 feet deep, that's what we're trying to catch. What are you going to do with the yellow eye if you catch it? Um, is this a trick question? Send it back because it's yeah. protected. Yeah. Duh. I guess this is going to be a red. Red? It is red, it's a good one. It feels heavy. Oh, and it is a, not a red. A, what is that? Olive. It's an olive. Olive okay. rock fish. Hold it up. <laughs> oh my gosh! That's a big one. Alright, what's your guess? What do you think this one is? I have no idea. An orange fish. I see it. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Bring it over here. Bring it over here. Bring it over here. Whoa. Ah. Wait. Oh. oh my god. No. Oh my god. Oh my god. All right, put it in the freeze pool. We didn't even get to eat the squid. Who cares about the squid? <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, this is a lingcock for sure. Almost there. Almost there. Oh, we got deep color. What do we got? Oh, that's a ling. That's a ling. That's legal. Big sheep head. Big sheep's head? I think so. It's doing big head shakes. Yeah, big head shakes. Near the end of the spool there. That's coming off. Time to get serious. Cooler's maxed out. We're on. We're on. We're on them, boys. This is a real one. I'd say so. It's gotta be a big sheep head or a big ling or something. It might be a cow cut, dude. Oh. oh my gosh. Oh. <sighs> All right, get the gap. All right. <laughs> Big wing. Oh my gosh. It could be, dude. Guys, have got him in 200 feet. We're supposed to be caught. Oh, 
no! <sighs> Dude, it might have been a shark. Yeah. <gasps> I wonder, I would do that. Let's just call that a shark. That looks like a good one. It's like head shakes. We're gonna bring him up and find out. We got deep color. It's kind of blue it's looking. A ling it's a ling. With the gaff. Look at this. That's what we call fishing in SoCal. Oh. That actually might be legal. I think he might be legal, dude. Nice. Oh, that's a big one. Where? We're out. We're out here. We're out here. All right. What do we think the verdict is? Do we think this is a burn? Well, I don't know. Your rod is gnarly. It could be a giant vermin or a giant ling. But, uh, it was on the drop. It's on the drop? As it was falling. I don't know if I trust this gaff. He's doing a circle. I think this is a burn. Big burn. Ooh. Whoa. Oh. That's, oh. All right. <laughs> That's really big. That is very big. On the slow pitch rod. Nice. Bigger than the last one? I have no idea. We'll find out. <laughs> Maybe it's just the split. No. <laughs> oh. Alright, slow down. Keep winding. Oh. Whoa! Oh. Oh. Alright, hold on, hold on. It's about to come off. Oh, and. It's about to pop off, and I don't have a net. Yeah. It was like a hole. Whoa. <gasps> Dude, nice. How are you hurt? What's going on, Max? three in the morning, we're going cotting. Day two, we're heading out to the cotting grounds. Um, we got Max and Hallie on the boat. We had a good day yesterday. Got some nice reds, um, two link on. But today we're going extra far for something extra special. So hopefully it pays off for us today. Sun is up. We're halfway there. I'm starting to get excited.
their knee. Oh, wow. That's their swim bladder. Yay, Ryder! Nice. <laughs> How's nice. it going, dude? Look, you can see what he's been eating. Oh my god. Squid. <laughs> More bait. Yeah. Wow. Bro. Bring it closer. Oh. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Woo. All right. Riders turn on the lane. We hope. We hope. How far off the bottom were you on that one? Pretty far? I have no idea. When I got hit initially, I was probably like, just getting hit off the bottom. I think that's kind of how mine was. Okay, so we're here back at the house. Um, had a couple good days of fishing, so we're gonna cut up our rockfish right now and get them ready for tacos later. Nice California lean cod. So we're gonna dry the fish off, get all the slime so it gets nice and ready to cut. So the meat on this guy's looking really good. Kept it chilled for two days on ice. Gutted and gilled right after we caught it, so the quality stays extra good. Oh, that's so good. Yeah, this is gonna make some really good tacos right here. Let's see. Nice wait. Sweet. On longer fish, I like to kind of portion it out. Um, makes for an easier, cleaner fillet sometimes. All right, so we got one side done. We're gonna flip it over to the next side. Once again, we're gonna Take our paper towels, clean off our, our station here, wipe the fish off to the best meat quality we can get here. All right. 
cut the last portion of the fish off. Looks really nice. And we're gonna move on to the next fish. Red guy. Pretty looking one. This is a vermilion rockfish. These are really good eating. Um, catch these off the coast of Southern California. And they are a personal favorite. <laughs> Gotta watch the spines on these guys because they will get you if you're not paying attention. Alright. Here's our first fillet. Beautiful white meat off the vermilion rockfish. It's gonna taste amazing. Excited. the process on the other side. Right now we're gonna, we brought the fillets inside and we're gonna take the skin off and get them ready for, for tacos tonight. So we're gonna dry them off, paddle the excess blood off, um, try to get all the scales as much as possible, clean it up a little bit. We're gonna cut the bones off. Slide the knife under the skin. Just like that. And then to take the rest of the bones off, they usually run around here so you can flip it. And run the knife down this spine. Just like that. And then go on the other side. It looks like a little finger here. Cut down the middle like that. And now you have a filet with no skin and no bones. 